Hi, I'm Justin Andel, Customer Account Manager at Western Computer. Today, Maher Malki, our NAV Functional Project Manager, will show you Microsoft Dynamics CRM integration in Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2016. So what is this concept of coupling? Well, what you'll find is under the Navigate section on the Customer Card, there is a new section of the ribbon called Dynamics CRM. And from here, what you can do is you can go ahead and, of course, launch the account record. Okay, this is launching the CRM account record directly from NAV. I can do a manual synchronization, forcing a sync to happen now, and we're going to talk about different ways that these synchronizations can happen. Or, of course, I can update account statistics and have it recalculate the data up in CRM and deliver new statistics for me here. And finally, the coupling concept. So the coupling concept here is what allows us to make that connection between CRM and NAV. To set up a coupling here, what you'll find on the left is the Dynamics NAV record with some need-to-know information. And here on the right, I can see how it's connected or to what account is CRM it's connected to. I can, of course, hit the drop-down and select a different account. Or if I just created a brand-new customer card, I can just put a check in the box here and have it create the new account for me over in CRM dynamically. Now, and I like showing this to you because it really shows you what's going on behind the scenes. There is an automatic synchronization that does this, but it's always good to know what it's doing, how it's doing it, and how you can override it or fix it if there's an error that needs to be resolved. This is the place where you would go. Now, of course, I'm focused on the account record here, but contacts have the same concept, items, and so on. It has the same coupling concept. That concludes today's video. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on all the latest video releases. Thank you for watching.